rant about Pottermore for a bit. I know we've already had a Pottermore week, but I just got a rant about it. I've just had the meaning to put a video about it on my main channel, and I just realized I need to make an underage wizardry video, and I'm just like, oh, so I'm gonna rant about it. Today, I found out, as some of you found out, that the opening of Pottermore has been put off till 2012. Now, this is a frustration, although I already have a Pottermore account, because yes, I'm going to be one of the first people getting a new account, because yes, I want to be resorted. I know that sounds really pretentious and really, oh, I know, I know the house is better than JK Rowling, but just stop. Stop right there, please. I've heard it all. I have literally gone through the Hufflepuff letter and contradicted almost every single point they make to my personality. And I'm not saying Hufflepuff is a bad house. Trust me, I love Hufflepuffs. A good chunk of my friends are Hufflepuffs. I'm just not a Hufflepuff. I even used to consider myself part Hufflepuff part Ravenclaw, part Gryffindor when I was in house denial. Yes, I'm not as brave as Harry, I'm not as outgoing as Ron, and I'm not as smart as Hermione, but I am a Gryffindor. It's in my blood. It's in me. It is me, and I'm not a Hufflepuff. And I hate the people that have been like full-fledged in the Harry Potter fan and with this house for like years, and they're like, oh, Pottermore sorted me this, I'm going to change it. Yes, I get it that it's J.K. Rowling's word and that she bent the house system, but she's not on the other side of the computer looking at your results and figuring out who she is. If a seven multiple choice questionnaire could figure out what house you're in, they would get rid of the sorting hat. Yes, I know the sorting hat is really magical and realistically it's somewhere like Hogwarts wouldn't get rid of it, but just listen to me for a sec. I am sure that if Hermione took the same quiz, she would be sorted as Ravenclaw. And if Harry had been sorted the same quiz, he might have been sorted as Slytherin. But it was the sorting hat in their brain, in them, not their choices, that figured out who they were. Our choices may be the things that make us who we are, but when it comes down to it, friggin' Luna Lovegood isn't gonna turn into a Death Eater. I am a Gryffindor. I don't care with an online quiz said whether it's made by JK Rowling or not and for those people who say I'm pretentious and in denial you are wrong. I've given this thought. I have been sorted like this for over two months now and it's not me and it hurts. It honestly hurts because people are acting like this website is law and people are acting like oh if this sorts you as this then you must be it. Then how in the world are the, the numbers even? They are within thousands of each other. If People in the world took this quiz and it was completely honest. That couldn't, that's not happening. That's not a coincidence because it's been like this for the whole time I've been on Pottermore and I've been on Pottermore since the end of August. There is something in the numbers which makes sense because they don't want one house having a bajillion people in it and that makes sense for this type of website. And me taking this quiz getting sorted as a Hufflepuff does not mean I am a Hufflepuff. Yes, in that day, I am not Gryffindor enough to become a Gryffindor, but that doesn't mean I'm not one. And if you disagree, I accept that, but accept my opinion, because this is my opinion, and my opinion is that I still wear red and gold, I still buy it, I bought this tie today, and I'm a Gryffindor, whether you like it or not. Sorry, Wizards, I'm sorry for this ranty video. I, you pick whatever theme you want, whether you want to talk about Pottermore or something that's just on your mind, because I'm going to New York this Thursday, and I don't really want to think of a theme. I just want to think about how awesome it's going to be in New York City. Today's magical because I finally got a red and gold tie because I've been I've been I've been repping the the movie colors for the purple and gold, but red and gold is where it's at. I mean, duh. Thank you for taking my rantiness, and Potsy, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>